computerization program to receive highest increase in 2022 DEP ed budget. As the country continues with its shift to digital education, the computerization program of the Department of Education, DEP ed, has seen a significant increase in budget allocation in its 2022 budget. The DEP ed computerization program, DCP, is aimed at providing appropriate technologies to all public schools that would enhance the teaching learning process and meet the challenges of the 21st century through provision of relevant IT infrastructure, networking facilities, as well as various information systems to all levels of governance of the department. During the agency's presentation of its 2022 National Expenditure Program NEP, at the House of Representatives on September 14, the DCP Dep Ed said that DCP received 11.3 billion pesos allocation for the 2022 NEP which is, approximately double the amount, allocated in last year's General Appropriations Act GAA, allocation. As an agency, Dep Ed is set to receive 629.8 billion pesos from its proposed 17.02 trillion pesos budget for next year, Under Secretary for Finance Annalyn Sevilla said. Overall, we have a 6% increase compared to this year's budget. The increase actually is more on the PS or the personnel services, she added. The DEPED's 2022 NEP is composed of 513 billion pesos for personnel service, PS, 96.6 billion pesos for maintenance and other operating expenses, MOOE, and 19.7 billion pesos for capital outlay. Dep Ed said that aside from the DCP, Sevilla said that the government assistance and subsidies, gas, including the senior high school voucher program, and funds for the operation of schools, MOOE, received higher funding for next year. These are the school MOOE or the budget that will go directly to our schools, and we thank the Department of Budget and Management for increasing the MOOE at the level of 9.41% for senior high school, 7.5% for junior high school, and 6.4% for our elementary schools," she added. Meanwhile, the budget for new school personnel positions will also enjoy a 31% increase for 2022. This, after the 20 billion pesos was allocated for additional 10,000 teaching items. The Human Resource Development Fund will also receive 1.89 billion pesos, which is 0.12% compared to this year's budget. Meanwhile, Dep Ed also appropriated 358 million pesos for the newly created program called the Priority School Health Facilities, in response to the coronavirus disease, COVID-19, pandemic. Thank you very much. And if you are interested videos like these, please support this channel by hitting like, sharing videos and if you are new on this channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell, all, so that you will be notified for the upcoming videos.